Hello and welcome to FT Beyond. Um, this is a pack that's not yet available to the public, but it soon will be. And we're going to do a little, little let's play through it. We are actually on the FTB1 server, so that's even cool. Oh. I have moved away from spawn because we need to be away from spawn. Uh, have I got enough for two chests? I have. Because I've got so much junk in my inventory, it's unreal. Let's check. No, <laughs> that's the wrong one. I wanted chess. So let's actually just do that. Thank you. And let's. Can we have wooden shears? Oh, sweet. I don't need all you either. Uh, let's get rid of that and that and that. So, yeah. We're just going to do a little let's play, and it's going to be all funds and things. I uh, don't know what else is in the mod pack. I haven't been properly through it to see what mods there is. I know there's as, as magic, as you can tell by my hot bar down below. There is an actual magic there. Two magic bars. I haven't done as magic, so I don't know what to expect from it. So it's going to be cool. Something different. We've got plenty of food. Oh, I've got some ender lily. Can I plant this anywhere? Yeah, I can. Sweet. So I've cleared out this area. I do need an actual sword, a sword, because I want to get some wool, because it does turn night time, believe it or not, so yeah, I need one more piece, because I already have one piece of wool, so let's grab you, noise, I'm um, probably going to need to do some mining, that could have been bad, I could have been in, uh, in that hole, Chuck you in there, get that. Uh, we're gonna need lots more wood. It's a good thing we've got like a forest near us. Uh, we've got some trees around us that I don't even know what it is because there's a white one over there and it's like, yeah, what's that? So, probably gonna gather a few resources, make a cut here, and we'll come back when I've got plenty of resources, like some um, iron and stuff like that. We are near a uh, Think of Slime Island as well, so that's even more, even better, and help progress as well. Would have been better if it was a pink Slime Island, but hey, do we have fast leaf care? No, we don't. I nearly fell down there. Ooh, what's that? As magic to all. Yeah, so I'm gonna make a quick cut, and I'll see you guys in a second. And I'm back, guys. Well, it's about nearly turning night time, um, but I've got a fair few was and a fair few um, gems and stuff like that, so that's uh, quite cool. Um, do I have anything cooking? I do not. We're going to actually jump straight into Endryo, which is this dude, the alloy smelter and the sag mill. But we're going to need some power, which is a sterling generator by the looks of it. So that's a thing. So let's get some of these up. So I actually need five of them. So we're going to have to do a bit more. And then, not you, we need these things, basic gears, two of even though it's going to give us one, so that's not too bad, uh, like that, and then grab you, we need another furnace, and then we need a piston, which is redstone and wood, what do I have, redstone, it's right there, why can't you grab it from the chest, job done, so now we can actually create a stone generator, so that's done, and then we need a sag mill, after we sleep, and sleep, just before all the zombies come and attack us. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We're safe. We're safe. So what have we got? We've got the stone generator. We need the alloy smelter, which is going to need an octave pasta, which we do need gold uh, nuggets for, which can actually go like this, this, and get real. Uh, copper is actually spawning on Y level um, 40 so that's not too bad so it's just a bit of searching round to get them actually we're going to need two of them because I'm sure uh, the segment needs one yes it does why did that just click off there I'm missing another one of these good job I got plenty of um, resources let's do that one more time and let's grab you which another piston and Actually, does the alloy smelt need a piston? No, it needs two furnaces. Three furnaces, should I say. 
and let's not uh, more or less done apart from you which we can actually go like that and that gives us the yellow smelter and then we need the sag mill which we are missing flint for some reason it's not pulling from the chest uh, not unless not that that please and the sag mill nice so let's sterling alloy and you so we've actually just jumped straight into tech instead of going the tinkers route so that was the stone generator alloy smelter and you so we're going to need to put some power in here. Have we got any more coal? Let's rob half of these from here. And then throw you in there. Which now gives us the opportunity to put stuff like you in the sag mill. Which will cook down and give us some stuff. Because if you press U on the gold, it will actually be uh, sag mill. Give us two pulverized gold. And the chance of copper and cobblestone. And we've got that straight off the bat. So we can actually take them, throw them in here, which will give us two ingots. I normally, like I say, would go Tinker's route, but I wanted to change things up. Out of power. Yeah, that's going to be a problem until we get um, a few things to start getting us up some more power. And obviously, we need to put a chest next to that. So if we get two chests, one either side, and then we configure, push out, and that will go into that chest, and then we'll get this one, spin it around, and then we'll push out into there. Nice. So semi-automatic, and it will do its job, but we do need better power for this. Why do we hear zombie? Have you seen the minimap? There's like a billion zombies over here. What are you doing, zombies? Oh, there's a skeleton down there. No thanks. I think I'll leave the skeleton there. So you're doing your job. You're going to take 10 years to power up. And we've got copper in there. So I'm actually going to put the ingots in there. Next job is actually grabbing ourselves a smeltery which we are going to get a smeltery just for Tinker's tools basically so we need you in there and then we need our seed bricks out which I've already went, up, went ahead and smelted up so that gives us our drain that gives us our casting table then we need our controller can you tell I've made these a few times <laughs> and then again round in a circle because we need our glass where it is to get a tank so that's everything then we just need a faucet and the rest can be turned into seed bricks if it would actually work noise so this is going to be over here until I get a house built um, actually let's not put it in the ground Probably not going to be enough bricks. I did have some more. There we go. Have I got anything to place down with? I'll just use this, even though it's going to be a waste of thing because it's going to turn back into cobble. And that's that done. And you're done. Sweet. One more in there. I'm going to put the controller in the middle you there and then the tank here and that should come on sweet if you want to know what texture pack i'm using i'm using the fearful 32 as well so that's quite cool right and this is just going to be used for tools because we always use tinkers for doubling and what i wanted to change over and go for actually something we don't use seem to use a lot which is obviously ender io so right let's throw all you in here job done actually best make sure it gives us back what I'm thinking it's going to give us back uh, doo -doo. and that was iron sweet so now we've got double doors easy <laughs> just from a bit of mining and then coming back up and crafting it can't go wrong but what else I want to craft 
is actually the mining dimension because that is actually in here. So if I do add this and then go for you, so we're going to need you, which is flint and steel, which we should have. Uh, do we have any iron in here? We have a bit. Let's take you as well. So let's create that. And then we need stone, which I'm thinking we're going to actually need a lot of. I might build a house out of this as well. It's something different. I just want a normal stone, please. I know. We don't need that. We're good. We're good. And you can make a stone pick out of flint. Really? So we've got you. Then put that in there. I actually don't know how many we need. Probably need a few. Let's put this over here so it's out of the way. And then use a spade. That work wonders. Made the perfect amount. Made the perfect amount. So let's grab this tool again and then light this bottle. Go through and sneak. I don't want to go through yet because I need to make other tools. So that's more or less done. Uh, let's chuck the rest of this on here. Oh, we were one shot. I like, um, the one probes tells you what's in the tanker and what's not. So if you hold shift, it actually tells you it's empty there. If you hold shift on this, it will actually tell you what's in the actual smeltery itself. So if we went ahead and threw some gold in, let's just grab this. Um, what wonders if we actually had a bucket and actually had some lava. So I might have to go and get some lava. Let's take you. Did I get my, yeah, I got back. So I need some lava. So I had to sleep before coming back. So let's throw you on there. And you should now have lava. Sweet. Let's put our gold in. Do we actually have any more? Uh, yeah, we do. We do have enough for some more seed bricks. I only want four. Well, that many will do. <laughs> So let's throw you in there, not the gold, because actually I can go in there now. So that's all in there, out the way, sweet. And then I need an ingot. I just remembered. It shall not craft an ingot. And that's all in there. So if we hold shift, that will actually tell us. I know it's really small and you can hardly just make that out. But it says 720 of molten gold on that. So that's actually quite cool. I like that little add on for the one probe. And you're done. Sweet. So we've actually got a fair few things done today. We've got basic and dry or so. We've got the mining dimension and we've got the tinkers. So what I'm going to do, I'm actually going to leave today's episode there and probably get into more tech for next time um start getting everything built up get some tech farms going and make some other things uh i do need a juicer i do know that because juicer is better nice and throw you in there and get some better food nice so what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna leave it there and I'll see you in the next one.